The overall goal of the following video is to familiarize the viewer with various techniques used for manual restraint and compound administration in mice and rats. Mice and rats can be restrained by a number of one- or two-handed techniques or with the use of plastic restrainers. Techniques for compound administration such as intraperitoneal, subcutaneous, intravascular, and intradermal injection methods are demonstrated in this video as well as oral gavage and intranasal administration. Learning how to handle animals confidently, gently, and safely is an important part of in vivo research. Animals should always be handled in a manner that's safe for both the animal and the researcher. Generally, people new to these methods may struggle as it takes time to become comfortable working with rodents. Rodents may also intimidate or frighten people that are new to working with them. Visual demonstration of dose administration and restraint techniques is key to both successful administration of the compound as well as to prevent distress or injury to the animal and the restrainer. Mice can be restrained manually using either a one- or two-handed technique. The first step of either method is to gently lift the mouse by the base of the tail onto the cage lid, wire bar cage top, or a similar rough surface. For the one-handed technique, Tuck the base of the tail between the third and fourth finger while gently pulling back on the tail. This will cause the mouse to grasp the surface and pull forward. Next, firmly grasp the mouse by the scruff with the same hand that is holding